Hey guys, it's Jill here from Lavender and Friends, your source of essential oil education and inspiration. My August LRP order has come, so I'm super excited. I'm gonna crack this open and uh, go through it. I did get the new Clarify oil, so I'll be cracking that bottle and letting you know my thoughts. Um, but I just wanted to do a quick video to show you what I got in my order. Now, before I dive into the unboxing video, I did want to quickly run through why I do a monthly order and what exactly the Loyalty Rewards program is. One of the big perks of having a doTERRA account is that you get a 25% discount off of the retail price, you get that wholesale price, and you also have the option to activate a monthly ordering program called the Loyalty Rewards program. The yeah, idea is pretty simple. It's sort of like a subscription box where you get to pick what you're gonna get every single month. It's a minimum of one product a month. Um, one point per month is the minimum order, or you can have as much as you want. It ships straight to your door, super easy. Log in, pick what you want, put it in your shopping cart, and on the day you've selected to have your order sent, it'll send it straight to your house, and then that order will reset for the following month. You then log in, take out what you don't need, swap your order around, again, put whatever you want, and then ship it straight to you. Now, one of the things I love about this is it's meaning that I'm swapping my shopping for things that are more healthy, a more natural product. It's helping me to get the best, the best price and the best value, and I'll explain that in a second. And look, I have two small children. Getting to the shops, not really fun at the moment. So it means I don't have to go and get a lot of stuff, which I love. So look, I'd love it if you pop in the comments, are you on the Loyalty Awards program? Have you activated it yet? Or do you just prefer to do monthly orders? I'd love to see what you guys are doing. Now, the really cool thing about the Loyalty Rewards program is it does reward you for your orders. And what I mean is in doTERRA, every product has a dollar value and a point value. So when you're purchasing your products, you can pay using your money or your commissions, or you can buy them using your points and you earn the points when you activate that loyalty rewards program. Because first of all, every time you do an order, you get 100% of the shipping back as points. You spend $8 on shipping, you're gonna get eight points back. On top of that, if you have an order that's greater than 50 points, uh, which is about maybe $60, $70, depending on what you're getting. So if your order is over 50 points, you're going to earn a percentage of your order back as points. Now, generally speaking, you start on 10%, which means if you did a 50 point order, you would get your eight shipping points plus your five, um, five points, and that means you'd get 12 points back. That's almost a bottle of lemon for free. That's actually, you get the toothpaste for free, you can get, um, you can get the hand moisturizer for free just from one order. Now, after three months where you've done a 50 point order and it doesn't have to be consecutive, you'll actually increase by 5%. So you'll go from 10% back to 15% back. Another three months and you'll go up to 20% back, then 25% back, and then eventually you'll get 30% back on your orders. And what that means is if you do a 50 point order, you're gonna get your eight product points, from, sorry, your eight shipping points, because you spent $8 on shipping, so you get eight points, Plus, you'll also be getting back 15% of your order. So if you did a 50 point order, that means, sorry, you'll be getting 30% back. So on a 50 point order, that's 15 points. So that means that you'd actually be getting about 23 points back off a 50 point order. So it's sort of like walking into Coles, spending 50 bucks, and they give you a $23 gift card to use the next time you shop. The points will expire after a year, so you do want to be um, redeeming them. And it's just such an amazing way to be getting rewarded for the orders that you're doing. On top of that, if your order is more than 125 points, and you do it before the 15th of the month, you get a free product every single month. And if you saw my post, you'll know I was cheering because the product of the month was already on my shopping list, which meant I didn't have to buy something I was already going to be buying. Or sometimes it's a really great way to try a new oil that you may not necessarily have bought for yourself. For example, Marjoram was the product of the month like yonks ago when I first joined. I would have never bought Marjoram because like, seriously, all I knew to, was that you could use it for cooking to make fajitas. 
And then because I got the oil, I tried it, I use it, and I'm, I now love marjoram. It's absolutely amazing. It's really good for sore muscles. It's really good for sleeping. And it just helped me to try something new. All right, so that's a little bit about the Loyalty Rewards program. I'm going to jump in and open up. All right, here we go. Hopefully there's no errors in my order because I haven't checked it. Okay. Oh, this is exciting. Okay, so we've got, got a couple of exciting things. So, first of all, did you know that we now have the mouthwash? Now, I absolutely love this mouthwash. It is seriously really good. Now, one of the cool things is when they brought this mouthwash out, they actually did a double blind placebo trial on this mouthwash. Now, for those of you who are not total complete science nerds, basically a double placebo is kind of like the gold standard. It's the, this stuff is really good. And one of the things they found was that it actually helps to, it, it, it really was clinically proven to help support oral hygiene. And it can be a really great addition to your routine to help your mouth to stay nice and healthy. So if you're using any other sort of mouthwash, here's a really simple way to swap your shopping. When you use up your current mouthwash, swap for this. Now, pop in the comments if you've tried this, if you love it, what your thoughts were. Not gonna lie, I've never used mouthwash before, and I was like, ooh, this is quite intense. Um, but now I absolutely love it. So I'm so excited that we have it in Australia now, and I don't have to order it from the US. Um, mouthwash. All right, ooh, now, this, all right. This is called the Intricate. If you have any friends that kind of want to try oils but aren't really sure and they're just wanted to literally dip a little toe in, tell them to get this. It's like 30 bucks and they get a 5 mil lemon, lavender and peppermint, which as you know is probably the three most versatile oils you can get. This makes a really fantastic gift and check it out, it finally comes in the new packaging. So it finally actually looked really pretty. So look at this, seriously guys, how cute is this new packaging? Oh, it even has like info on the back. And then, oops, you open it up like this. And look, comes all beautiful. Oh my gosh, I'm seriously in love with this. And it even comes with, look, little booklets about the oils. This is actually all really new, I didn't know this. This is so cool. And it's even got like a little safety, essential oil safely, essential oil safety booklet. So this is awesome. If you're thinking of getting someone a little gift, look at how seriously pretty that is. I'm so excited. So this is definitely a lovely little thing you can be using. And yeah, it's just a little five mil intricate. All right, yes, okay. So shout out to my girl, Alicia, Alicia Wenner, the women's health uh, fundraiser, which we both presented at, she talked about low tox living, which is like her happy place. And one of the things she shared about was natural deodorants and pit detoxing. So long story short, I've been inspired to get this, but I'm not really going to go into a bit more detail as to why or where I'm going to be sticking this because I'm actually going to get Alicia on here with me and we're actually going to do a live together um, sharing about how you can use a mud mask to help with detoxing your pits and why it's so important. So little teaser, keep your eyes out. We will be doing that shortly. Um, we just got a book in a date where we're both available, um, but that'll be quite fun to do. And hallelujah, more cap stickers. Yay! Um, first of all, super excited because now there's multiples of the really popular oils. Whoops. And all the new oils. So this is exciting. I wonder if Clarify's on here yet. Oh, the um, yoga collection's on here. Clarify? No, not yet. Anyway, new cap stickers. If you ever run out of the cap stickers, they're a dollar for a sheet. And what I do when I make my rollers, I actually stick the cap stickers on the roller so I remember what oils I put on. And if it was a specific recipe, I'll actually write the number of drops on the cap stickers and that way I can remake my recipe. Because I had, when I first started out, I had this tendency where I'd make all these rollers and use them and love them and have no idea what I put in them, which was really annoying. So now I'm a bit more organized. All right, oil time. Okay, so, hey Emma, 
Alyssa's on LRP and Sally. Oh, sneaky Sally. That's a good point. If you do the express shipping, which is $18, you actually get 18 points, which is actually an investment into future orders. Now, that's actually really, really clever because one thing you learn is there are some products, actually quite a few products, where the point value is lower than the dollar value. So what that means is when you use your points to buy stuff, you actually get it for cheaper. So I actually have, and it's funny you say that because I was using this chart. I actually have this awesome chart that was given to me. So for example, Helichrism is $135, but it's only 95 points. So if you're getting those eight shipping points back every time, or in Sally's case, she's getting 18 points back on shipping every time, she could save up and get that Helichrism for 95 points, which if she's using her shipping points would be $95 instead of spending $135. So I like your thinking. Yarrow Pom, yes, very true, 114 points, but $140. That's another great one. Top tip, if you guys wanna do this, get Melissa from the US. In Australia, Melissa is $232, or I think it's about 232 points as well. In America, it's 132. Winning. That's why I always get my Melissa from the US. All right, let's crack these oils. So, first of all, we have Whisper. Now, this is the women's perfume blend. It's very, very musky. So, I like to mix it with a citrus like lime, um, but some people just douse it on themselves. If you like your floral musky smells, you're gonna love this one. And um, super beautiful blend, really good for your hormones, makes you feel amazing, smells really lovely. And one of the things I love about it is it actually blends with your own unique chemistry and it smells different on everyone. And people used to always say that to me and I never believed them because I'm the most skeptical person in the world. And then I was at a training day and I was sitting next to this lady, I'm like, oh my gosh, you smell amazing, what are you wearing? She goes, oh, I'm wearing Whisper. And then at lunchtime, I sat next to another person and I was like, oh, you smell amazing. And she was also wearing Whisper. And then at the end of the day, same story, sitting next to someone, thought they smelled amazing and they were smelling Whisper. But each of the three ladies smelled completely different. So it's a really beautiful way to be replacing your nasty, chemical, synthetic, laden, toxic perfumes with something that's a really natural alternative. And it is a smell that really does linger. It's got these beautiful base notes. So I find when I, when I put it on, it just lingers for hours. So that smell whisper. And lemongrass. All right. Love, love, love lemongrass. I'd love to actually know if you popped in your comments, what do you guys use your lemongrass for? I have a fun story I'll share with you, which if you've watched my, <laughs> if you've watched my videos, you'll have heard it before. I have a three-year-old who one day decided that she was going to turn her bedroom into a tiger with a permanent marker by drawing stripes all over the wall. And we had just moved into our new house. So total freak out. Uh, grabbed my lemongrass, put it on the wall, and literally the permanent marker just came straight off. So lemongrass, amazing for cleaning. Good for grease stains, pike stains, cleaning, it smells beautiful. It's also a really good one for cooking. I use it a lot in my Thai curries, my um, anything that requires lemongrass. This is a really beautiful one. I love mixing it with lavender. It's one of my favorites. It makes it smells like this really fancy day spa and you just, it's kind of like uplifting and calming all at once. It's beautiful. And emotionally, it's actually the oil of cleansing. So if you're someone who really struggles with letting go, or maybe you struggle with attachment to things, lemongrass is gonna be your bestie. So if you've been following my page for a while, you'll know I've been conmariing my house. Um, so I'm following the Marie Kondo, the magic of tidying, and it's all about going through your home and only keeping that which sparks joy. So you, you go through every single item in your home and you decide, do I want to keep this? Now, I'm really emotionally attached to stuff. And it, it's really becoming quite apparent to me how I'll have something that I'll have, maybe a positive memory of it, and I literally have not used or touched this item in 10 years, but I just can't get rid of it. Like I just, it's like I can't let go. And even though it actually doesn't even spark joy anymore, I really struggle to just give stuff away. And I guess there's that guilt because I'm like, I paid money for this, I feel guilty, I should be using it. And so then when I look at it, 
it's this conflicting emotion of, well, I used it that one time and I really liked it, but now I kind of feel guilty because I don't use it. And I don't know, am I the only one who does this? Do you guys feel this as well? And so what I found is lemongrass actually really helps me to just break that emotional attachment, look at it rationally and go, does this spark joy? Do I use it? Or would it be better off giving it away where it can be used and loved and actually have a purpose rather than just sitting there on a shelf making me feel guilty. So um, definitely been using a lot of the lemongrass lately and it's been really helpful. And another use for lemongrass, sore muscles. Absolutely love massaging this on. Dilute it, it is a, it's, it's quite a warm oil. Um, so make sure you're diluting if you're applying it topically. Uh, and it really gives that really warming sensation. So really, really great for warm up for any, if you've got any stiffness in your body, really great one to be using as well. Now let's see, um, Emma uses it for cooking. Asians love lemongrass. Yes, yes you do. <laughs> I've got an Asian cookbook and like every recipe has lemongrass. Um, and cleaning. Uh, Lissa likes diffusing it. Yes, I love diffusing it as well. Yeah, super cheap. It's like $13 a bottle. It's definitely worth its while. Um, and Alyssa, oh good, you feel the same way about getting rid of stuff. That makes me feel good too. Lemongrass with baking soda and vinegar. Yes, excellent. You guys can have to clean my house and it'll smell amazing. All right, next up we have our lime. Now, Lime was the product of the month. As I said, it was actually already on my shopping list. Love Lime. Oh gosh, what do I use it for? Cooking, I use it for cleaning, I diffuse it. It's a really zesty oil. So if I've been, had a really crap night's sleep, I love popping in the diffuser in the morning because it just makes me feel happy and smiley. Um, I love mixing it with Whisper. That's my perfume blend, is these two together. Um, I love it with Douglas fir, which you guys know I'm obsessed with Douglas fir, but Douglas fir, grapefruit, and lime is my happy place blend. Um, and also really good for cocktails. Weather's going to start warming up soon. Um, I One of my favorites is Malibu lime soda water and cranberry juice. Or if you have a Corona, just add a drop to your Coronas. Um, very good. All right, what else do I have? Oh, right. Lemon. This is in my order like every month. Like seriously, <laughs> every single video I do, I talk about lemon. Um, it's great for cleaning, super versatile, helps neutralize odors. I actually add a drop to my water every morning, just helps me to get my system going. Now with taking oils internally, using them for flavoring use, I always recommend firstly, always read the labels on the bottle um, and always use your own discretion, use your own judgment you can use our oils aromatically, topically, and some can be used internally. Um, it's up to you which way you wanna choose to use them. Lemon is also, as I said, good for cleaning, good for getting grease off of things. Um, we use it to wash our fruit and veg with. We just fill up the tub with some water, splash in some vinegar, add some lemon, wash our fruit and veggies. I use it to clean my dishwasher. I use it to clean my laundry. Um, it's seriously like such a versatile oil and it's also another cheapie, which is good because we go through a lot of lemon. And I also have, yay, finally, my peppermint beadlets. So I have recently joined a gym. Yay, lots of fun. Um, and I've been taking a drop of peppermint before I work out because peppermint actually increases your aerobic endurance. There was this really, really cool study where they gave peppermint to athletes. And because peppermint actually smooths your bronchial passageways, it helps you to have better breathing, helps to support your breathing. And when you're exercising, you wanna have lots of oxygen because your heart's pumping and you're breathing deeply. So I find taking a drop of peppermint before I exercise helps me to breathe better. It helps me have nice fresh breath, which is always a bonus for everyone in the gym. And I also find peppermint's really good for digestive support. And oftentimes when you work, you can kind of get an upset tummy because you're working too hard or you're just you know pushing yourself. And I find the peppermint really helps to settle that. So now I can actually just pop a beadlet in my mouth nice and easy uh, rather than having to sit there and use my peppermint bottle and look like a slightly crazy lady at the gym. So I'm just going to open this up and show you what they look like. I'm not going to take one now because peppermint hypes me up and it's bedtime. All right, so 
Here we go. That's what it looks like. I don't know if you can see that. It's like this itty bitty tiny gel ball. Can you guys kind of see that? There you go, now I can see. And it's actually equal to about a third of a drop of peppermint. So you just pop it in your mouth, pop it and away you go. Hey, Melinda. Now, Melinda's the DIY queen, so I'm sure she's gonna jump in and share lots of uses with you guys about how she uses her oils too. Um, <laughs> yay, Emma, I can't wait. We'll have lots of fun together. We can oil up the world. All right, what else do we have in here? Oh, <gasps> sorry guys, I'm gonna need a moment. I'm just gonna need a moment. It's my baby, my Douglas fur. My Douglas fur. So, do you guys have this? I'm just curious, have you ever had the experience where you smell an oil and you instantly fall madly, utterly, totally and completely in love with it? If so, pop in the comments what oil it is. For me, it was Douglas fur. And my friend, my beautiful friend, Alison, will tell you how I went to her house and she has a three-tiered oil box and I smelled something and I was like, I have to find this oil. And I went through three tiers of oils to find it. And it was this little beauty, Douglas fur, and I am completely in love with it. And I've been in love with it ever since. I have no idea why I am so drawn to this oil, but just smelling it makes me happy. Now, lucky for me, it's actually a really cool oil. Very good for respiratory support. So um, whenever my kids get a bit snuffly or aren't feeling great, we crack this one out. Um, it's, it's, it's about generational wisdom and about learning from the past and respecting your elders and, um, you know, I guess breaking, breaking negative past habits and, um, you know, reflecting upon the knowledge that's past, which I find kind of interesting. And um, cool thing about Douglas fir in terms of the sourcing. So Douglas fir was introduced into New Zealand um, because they wanted to use it for cheap logging. What happened was they found that it actually grows something like super crazy fast in New Zealand, like way faster than where it's naturally meant to grow. And the problem with Douglas fir is it actually suffocates everything underneath it. So it creates pretty much a desert on the floor of the forest. Nothing can grow underneath it. So it was basically became this massive weed and it was spreading like crazy and it was suffocating everything. And it was a real problem in New Zealand. Now doTERRA came in and this is one of the few oils that is actually not sourced where it naturally natively grows. It's actually sourced somewhere where it's been an introduced species. But the reason they do this is because the, they're able to actually cut down the trees, use it to create the oil and then replace the, the cut down trees with native New Zealand, um, native New Zealand plants. And they're actually able to regenerate the landscape that has been so badly destroyed. And it was really interesting at convention hearing um, people from New Zealand talk about it. And one of, the, one of the massive things that really struck home to me was they shared about how one of the biggest issues is it's such a rural area, people really struggle to find jobs. And so people who want to work on the land and want to work close to home and close to their families are having to commute really long distances. Now that really struck a bone with me because I live on the central coast and for a long time I was having to commute to Sydney, which on a good day is like an hour and a half. Look, it could be anywhere from an hour and a half to two hours to get to work and to get home and it, it puts phenomenal stress on your family. And my husband, he was having to commute as well. And like when you're a mom and you're at home and you've got two kids and your husband's leaving at 6 a.m. before the kids are even awake and he doesn't get home till after the kids go to bed, like it's heartbreaking. It's heartbreaking for your husband who has to be away all the time. It's heartbreaking for you because you don't get to spend time with the person you love. It's heartbreaking for the kids. And so one of the things that really just, it made me so happy was hearing that by sourcing this oil from New Zealand, this Douglas fir, they're able to create all these amazing local jobs for people. So people aren't having to leave their families. They aren't having to commute. And I don't know about you, but that just makes me so excited for all these families that are able to be reunited simply because of this amazing oil. And that's something that I, I just really, really hit home with me. So it already was my favorite oil, let's be honest, but that was another reason why I just absolutely fell in love with it too. Now, Narelle's just saying how she loves Citrus Bliss. And um, yeah, Emma, exactly. Same issues with Blackberry and Victoria. It's, they introduce something and then it just goes gangbusters and suddenly they're having to go, oh no, 
how do we deal with this? So I love the fact, and it, look, if you guys are interested in this stuff, definitely check out the Source to You website, which is www.sourcetoyou.com. You can actually learn all about where our oils come from, how they get them, and you know, meet some of the people behind these oils. And it really does just blow your mind what a positive impact doTERRA can be having on this global scale. All right, ha <laughs> ha, hubby will be happy. Clary Calm, this is the Women's Monthly Blend. Um, this is amazing. <laughs> Sometimes I think if I was stuck on a deserted island, what oil would I have to have? Clary Calm is definitely in my top five. Um, basically, it is the Women's Monthly Blend, so I use it to support my hormones, to help regulate it. I have polycystic ovaries, but not polycystic ovary syndrome, because um, I'm really special like that. And this oil has been an absolute lifesaver because I actually went quite a number of years without any period at all. And when it returned, it was agonizing. And honestly, with this, every one to two hours, I just rub it on my lower abdomen and you just, you feel that tension release and it's just such a good feeling. I know a lot of people who actually wear it all month long, they use it as a perfume. It's a really great hormone balancing one. A lot of people who are um, going through fertility protocols often have Clary Calm in, involved in that fertility protocol. Um, so if that's something you're interested in learning more about, definitely send me a message and I can chat with you a bit further because that is something people often do message me privately. Um, and I also love it because I turn into an absolute rage emotional wreck when it's my period and I get really, really angry for no reason. And I put this on and again, it's just that tension releases and I feel much, much calmer. So uh, Clary Calm is a must have in our house. All right, what else do we have? We have lavender. Again, another staple in our house. Uh, lavender is really well used. It's like a Swiss army knife of oils. Like it's well used for everything. Um, in particular, we use it for sleep to help support healthy sleep habits. We use it for um, skin irritations, any sort of bug bites, anything where you need a calming influence, whether it's calming your skin, calming your mind. Um, really, really great oil, very, very powerful. Um, recently, I was gardening and I'm allergic to like 95% of Australian plants, so why I go gardening is beyond me. Um, and I actually ended up getting a horrific allergic reaction from about here right the way up my arm. It was really not very stylish. It's why I didn't do any live videos last week, pretty much. Um, lavender, frankincense, and tea tree were my lifesavers. I could put them on every one to two hours. I could douse a couple drops on and it just provided the most instant relief. It just soothed the most agonizing, painful reaction. Um, and so very, very grateful for my lavender. Uh, at the Women's Health Day that we did, the Women's Health event, uh, Jodie Crowley shared about oils for pregnancy, um, birth and beyond. And this was one of the oils she said that she uses all the time, especially for things like nappy rashes, upset teething babies. So again, super, super versatile oil. Really, really, really beautiful. All right. I was all excited, but it's not in here. Great. All right. Well, I'm really sad because I promised you guys I was getting the Clearify oil and it's not actually in here, which means it's probably on back order. They didn't ship it. All right. No dramas. Uh, one of the things I love about doTERRA is the fact that they have an awesome, awesome member services. So if anything's ever missing from your order or not there, um, just give them a ring and have a chat to them. So I'll be giving them a ring tomorrow. Um, it is 02801550080 is the phone number. Um, just give them a ring. So I will be ringing them tomorrow. But to finish off with, we have our beautiful Motivate Oil. Now, Motivate is one of the emotional aromatherapy blends. So what doTERRA did is they actually looked at the chemical constituents of certain types of oils and paired them together with the focus being on creating oils that were gonna support your emotions. So the Motivate oil, by, for example, is a mince and citrus. Now, mince, as we know, they 
pep you up, they help you get focused, they make you really alert, they're really, really beautiful. And the citrus oils are both uplifting and grounding. So what that means is when you pair them together, first of all, they smell amazing, but second of all, they help you to be really alert, they help you to be really focused, and they also help you to stay grounded so you're not just flying around off the handle, but you can actually really focus. And so that's the Motivate blend. It's this beautiful aroma, um, and it's really, really good one if you need some motivation. It's the Encouraging blend, so if you need a bit of a kick in the pants, um, I usually diffuse this when I have to vacuum because it smells nice. And then it, it really does get you motivated. And in fact, my dad, who is a uni lecturer, was complaining when he was doing some paper marking that he was feeling really flat. So I made him a roller with Motivate, Peppermint and Wild Orange. And I was like, Dad, you've got to put this on your wrist. And he was like, are you serious? Because he's not a super huge oil fan. But he did it and he actually said it really, really helped him. And now he uses it every time he has to mark papers. So Motivate's a really beautiful oil. Well, I'll have to give doTERRA a ring and get my clarify. And then I'll have to do another video showing my reaction, which I'm a bit bummed about. So sorry about that, guys. But thank you guys for tuning in. Um, thank you for joining me. If you are interested in learning more about essential oils, I have a number of intro classes. If you check out my video section, you can watch them. If you are excited and want to start your oil journey and you're not currently working with any other oil educators, love to help you get started. You can just jump straight on my website, which is www.lavenderandfriends.com or send me a message and we can have a chat about getting you started. Or else if you just follow the instructions on my pinned post, it'll take you step by step on how you can get started. If you found this video helpful, I'd love it if you could give it a thumbs up or a little love heart. Feel free to tag any friends. If there was maybe an oil I talked about that you think could really help a particular friend, definitely feel free to tag them and um, you know help share the oils with everyone. And uh, thank you guys so much for watching. And little shout out because um, my next online class is going to be on Thursday night at 8 p.m. I'm going to be sharing a bit about what it means to uh, teach others about oils. So if you are thinking of starting a doTERRA business or you wanted to share the oils with your friends um, or maybe you want to get a bit of commission because you really like the idea of oils but you're not able to invest in them financially, definitely tune in on Thursday night and make sure you register to get tickets via the events tab as that way I can actually email you a copy of the presentation afterwards. All right, well, hope you guys have a lovely evening and thanks for joining and watching. Cheers.